Dan, 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 dan. Welcome to Everything Another Podcast Series. With me is uh, the white chasing, white slurping, white home wrecking, Kathy Bagaret. <laughs> with me, I have the queen of the Sundals, but ever so single. <laughs> Shasha. <laughs> no. Well, it's season two, and it's true, I'm still single. Yeah. Which is why we decide to bring back the Bachelor format from mm. last season. One time I fart in someone's mouth. <laughs> this is not a question at all. But they- We've got a hot, hot hottie with you today. Yeah. And if you are interested also, you leave in the comment section. I will leave his Instagram and then you can follow. And if you have anyone to recommend to my dear friend Shasha, uh-huh. please also leave it in the comment section below. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> What do you consider as SPG, Cathy? Okay, the scientific definition of (laughs) SPG is an Asian lady Mm. who dates a white man. To be specific, Singaporean who only date white men. It stands for Sarong Sarong Party Party Girl. Girl. I like to think the reason why they call it Sarong Party Girl is because white is so right, it's Sarong. on a t-shirt, girl. Yes. Would you consider yourself a sarong party girl? <sighs> to be fair, you've only dated white. Yeah, you know what? For the longest time, I feel like I don't want to admit that I am an SPG. But... But the track record... Is she's a home wrecker. <laughs> <laughs> you want to go there? The track record <laughs> shows... <laughs> I hate that you are editing this. <laughs> the track record shows that yes, I have dated a plenty of white folk. Even the Malaysian you did was half white. <laughs> you okay? You get it yourself? I think the stigma locally is that if you date white, you are the money chaser. Yeah. Yeah, you're just into dating their money. Yeah. And there's nothing wrong with that as well. <laughs> <laughs> there are some perks that come with it. Sometimes they come and then the company will pay for the apartment that they live in, right? And the apartment is very nice. Hey, you no need to pay for location for shoot. You just use their house. <laughs> she is speaking from experience. <laughs> She's used her dates story. to shoot her I Instagram have, content. In fact, my crew has never met this man at all. But <laughs> we've used his house plenty of times. So I guess now uh, it is for us to try the Bachelor format, the Mina Matchmaker with a white man himself. We've got high and low, one of the most many handsome faces in Singapore. He is from the exotic country of France. Canada lah, you are ah, from Canada. Are you are French Canadian, can? Uh, yes, but I'm from Luxembourg. Oh God. He's from the exotic city, city or uh, state. Country. country. He's country. from the exotic country of Luxembourg. Yes, but uh. he's also very bold. Uh. Ah, and we have with us Max Ruder. Wow. Hi, Hi Max. Max. Wow, bawa roti. Oh, how you smell like a fresh baguette early in the morning in my mouth. Oh, oh, oh. Max, you always have a baguette with you or what? Um, yes, most of the time. So okay. long your baguette. Ah, hey. Wow, very nice. You can eat with curry, very nice. When you dip it in. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you dip it in. <laughs> you never, you never eat the French baguette <laughs> curry man. The innuendo or the really? Really, no, it's really <laughs> nice. <laughs> Chicken curry you eat. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming on set. Thank you for having me. Uh, can we introduce you a little bit to our fans who look at your face and go like, wow, what a beautiful man. Tell us who you are, what you do. Nothing much. I mean, uh, I've you don't do anything. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I work for Sephora actually, um, oh, as a uh, project manager in supply chain. No, we don't have to steal anymore lah. Uh, my daddy's paying this, it's on his check. Ah, uh, yeah. I actually have 30% discount if you, you want. Have 30% discount? No so you don't have way! To steal really? 30%? Yes. Get anything out of Get whatever you want. Get whatever I want? Get whatever you want. We're gonna go on a day on Sephora. Sephora! Uh, Max, Max, have you ever gone on a date with a Malay girl before? Yes. Oh! Who? 
first one I did it in Singapore was actually Malay. Oh, cool. Oh. And what was the experience? Like? Was it fun dating Malay girls like us? Um, was interesting, I would say. Interesting. What does that mean? Yeah. Elaborate, um, please. Yeah. I mean, it was very different from what I was used to back in Europe or back in uh, North America. Yeah, it's true. Okay. Malay girls are cut also. <laughs> but we don't have the clay, right? Right? <laughs> we don't. We, we cut. We circumcise. Yeah, but... She doesn't have a clay. <laughs> You're turning red, Max. I... No. No. Huh? What was the experience like? Was it enjoyable? And she was very special. Even if she was Malay, she was she had a drinking problem. Oh, oh. look! We're calling this out. What's her name? <laughs> what is happening? We're calling the police. <laughs> what is happening? This episode. Okay, okay uh, but I have to agree with you. I think you have a drinking problem. <laughs> <laughs> no, I have to agree with you. I feel like with some of the white men I dated, they don't realize how like dramatic and fiery Minas are. are. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we are, we are. Yeah, we are. Like one time I found out that this guy, it was a situation ship and we had clear boundaries. We said like, okay, we are allowed to see each other. And then when I started seeing other people, he got upset. So I'm like, okay, fine, I won't see other people. But then I found out on his phone, another girl was messaging him. I saw it and then I go back to the house, right? He was asleep. I say, who is this messaging on your phone? I thought you don't want to talk to other people. And if you do, we will talk about it. Then he's like, no, no, no. I try to come up with story. I take the phone, I smash onto the wall. Everything break and I leave. For me, I'm not a psycho, baby. <laughs> I'm, I'm just a normal girl. Okay, okay. So okay. now, we are going to get you to play the Bachelor format with us again. At the end of it, you must pick the least psychotic Mina that you would consider dating. Okay, Max. Okay, one in French is what? Oh, 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 I, I, I always say that in bed. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so much visual. <laughs> Question. Uh. Question number one. Mm. Yes. If France is the city of love, and you are the embodiment of Singapore, <laughs> what is Singapore's the city of? Singapore is the city of gardens and greenery. You never <laughs> shave, is it? <laughs> she never shave. Yes. No, we I, always IPL. smell beautiful. Okay. Yeah. Do you like that? Have you dated smelly girls before? Yeah, the, actually the smelly girls. <laughs> 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 she she do not watch this, man. She did not watch this, man. You know all Malay girls are smelly, okay? Yeah. Just her and your ex. <laughs> <laughs> I want um, each of you to show me your best French kissing face. Oh. Shasha, you start. How close you want to be? Shoot to the camera. Oh, ah, no. <laughs> He's totally like. Okay, okay. I, I'll okay. show this way so you and camera can see, okay? Okay. Maybe like this. Jesus. Oh. Ah, sort leader, no? Hey, I know. Oh. Hey, I sort the leader. Like that. Hey. Okay. Nine, okay. ready? Wow, wow, wow. <laughs> okay, we show both at the same time, then you see, okay, which one you like. Um, actually, if I have to kiss someone, I will, kiss, I will go for Shasha. Why, eh? Who wouldn't want that? If Sheridan Gardens is known as Little France, where will Little Paris be? Serangoon Garden lah, Sheridan Gardens. Ah, Where's ya? Where is Sheridan Gardens? Serangoon, Serangoon. If... If some guy is Little France, Little Paris, Little Paris is in my clip because I still have it. <gasps> yeah. I'm as a hot lane. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> little Paris for me would be our little home where I will cook you French cuisine every time you come home Don't from trust work. her, she cannot cook. If you can give me Three French dishes. Hey. I will go for this one. I can give. I, I, he asked me like, escargot, onion soup, ham and cheese croissant from Delhi France. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. No. Then? Coq avant. Escargot. I said that. Everyone is a no escargot. Everyone will use it once. And le pasteur 
de fettuccine. Pasta Italian. Yeah, but I say in French, right? I did, right? Le, le pasta. I can speak French better than her. Uh. Salut, je m'appelle Chacha. Je suis Singaporean. Uh, je suis oh. 30 et 30. Years old. <laughs> also, omelette du fromage. <laughs> Um, rental surge has been crazy in Singapore. Like, how do I do I house a future with you? Did you know that if you press here, nothing happens? And if you press here on the show, nothing happens. But, but if, if you, you press, press his, his number into your phone, he can make things happen. happen. With eight years of experience assisting over hundreds of first-time buyers, Fidaos have helped clients who are purchasing their first house who are simply clueless like us. Sombol. So for us, what are some of the things that first time buyers need to know when getting their first homes? Okay, so although your loan period is 25 years, you might not be able to use CPF throughout that whole 25 years. Okay. So because there's a maximum amount for the CPF usage, and if you buy much older flat, then that amount will be lessened. So is it a good time to buy or sell now? So the market right now is at its peak. So for sellers, definitely it's a good thing. But for buyers, don't worry, the property market is stabilizing. So if you're a young couple hoping to purchase your first home or have a minimum occupation period BTO for sale Or if you are like my loser friend hey. here who is turning 35 soon and looking to purchase an HDB resale flat under the single scheme or a private property Then, then press Fidaos on, on Instagram, Instagram and TikTok, TikTok for your property questions And more info and content on your first home So I found Fidaos, mm -hmm. if I press you what happened? Oh, why not we find out? Oh. Yeah, let's okay. go. My agent. Kind of. yeah, yeah, let's... I guess no more single scheme. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> what number two? <laughs> How do I do I house a future with you? Um wow, this is very difficult. Because you know why or not? At first I didn't feel pressure, but I feel like your standard is very high. Your standard ah. is very right. high. As a Molly guy, I pressure. Now suddenly all my sweat coming out, now I will be smelling. Hey, so my from they just now, I never sweat, you know. You know, I don't usually sweat, but I feel like you are putting a lot of pressure on us, you know, for this game. I mean, you're creating a correlation with the Mellie girls now. Yeah. <sighs> Masamness. And the smell? I think it's you, I think yeah, you are the problem, right? Okay, so my bag is quite long. Oh! I, I will give it to you and you need to show me how you will handle it. Handle it? Ladies. Sell you. Mon poupon. Je t'aime. Je t'aime. Et tu maman. Et tu papa. Mon frère. Mon soeur. Mon grand-père. Mon grand-mère. Est-ce que je peux aller aux toilettes, s'il vous plaît? Can I go to the restroom, please? If I'm a buffalo. Uh, <laughs> a bottle of wine. A bottle of, oh, a bottle of wine. <laughs> In a hey, la. La. Okay, okay, if you were a bottle of wine. Yes. What would be your name and how would you describe your flavor? I will be green tea. <laughs> because I am healthy, lean, and sometimes bitter. Bitch be calling people fat right? <laughs> <laughs> I am Fanta Orange. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Fanta Orange because I'm fizzy and effervescent. Uh, I'm sweet and sour, but at the same time, after you have a taste of me, you will then know the meaning of Hari Raya. Oh, wow, that's really good. Next question. If my parents were to come to visit Singapore, mm. where would you bring them for the first meal? I will bring them to my house because I know that the French love their cooking, so I will take a skills future course to learn how to cook French food. Well, you think my parents will travel like 6,000 kilometers just to eat uh, French cuisine again? I <laughs> would take them to La Passat. <laughs> and I would personally tell song number six, Chi, 
<laughs> I pay, but I cook. And then I will sweat profusely. And I will fan, fan, fan the sati. And my parents will say, wow, she's such a hardworking, devoted woman. So she knows, wow, she's the last Malay girl on earth. Good, but uh, Lao Pasta is very touristy, huh? It's not very local. No, no, no. Okay, then what you want? What you want? Very local. 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 By choking us. <laughs> I'm ready. The girl I choose is Shasha. <gasps> oh, I win again! <laughs> you gotta kiss my forehead, sorry. <laughs> oh my god! And then after that, then we can kiss on the lips. <laughs> Max, thank you so much for joining us. You're a beautiful man with a, a very steadfast personality. Yes. You know what you want. And if you think you are the girl who knows he is the one that want you, uh, follow him on his Instagram here. And remember, don't have body odor. Wow, Mati, he's so perfect and beautiful. Yes. His hair, his eyes, his long and white smile. Yes, and you too can unlock your smile with Zenyum. Zenyum is Singapore's fastest growing dental brand that provides affordable teeth straightening solution that treats mild to complex teeth conditions. To get started, simply submit a free smile assessment at the link below. Next episode on Epic Minas, the podcast series. Did you say Fauzi artist? He spoiled his entrance because he got the wrong Fauzi. So now we have a fun game segment about okay. how much we know about Singapore. I'm scared. What's yours? Joseph swimming schooling. What's yours? David. Mine is Joseph Bain schooling. <laughs> <laughs> Come on now.